Hello to my two comic book readers out there, Mike from Comic Frontline here, and welcome everybody to my comic review. Once again, Sidus comic book is being reviewed a little bit late. If you want to know the reasons why, just go check out my previous video of Exo Man War issue number 16 to find out the reasons why, and you'll find out there. But in this review, I've been reviewing a comic book digitally from IDW, and I've been waiting to read this book and review it to you guys. Now, Sonic the Hedgehog. Issue number six, the showdown between Sonic the Hedgehog and Shadow the Hedgehog. And by the way, I want to show you guys this cover actually, because this is my favorite cover of uh, that. So, what happens when they encounter it? Well, they did talk about what happened previously, where Eggman Land being built and stuff like that. And it starts off where it left off last time, where Sonic encountered with uh, Shadow, with the grim anti-hero, and Rouge the Bat, who's a secret agent that's with Shadow, saying that Shadow heard him say he was rebuilding Eggman Land, and we all know how Shadow can be stubborn about that. And Sonic's trying to say, you know, uh, easy Shadow, just take it easy. He's not Dr. Eggman, he's more, he's uh, Handyman Mr. Tinker, he totally lost his memory, and blah, blah, blah. And with Shadow not listening to Sonic, he's like saying you're not listening and you're not going to touch him. There's some artwork, by the way, which is drawn really amazing. And well, with all that happening, that's how the showdown begins. The rivalry of video games and that's really something. So then uh, the Chaotix team talks to uh, Rouge the Bat about... Um, you know, what were you thinking about bringing Shadow here? And then Rouge is just explaining how Shadow was already looking for Eggman to ensure he wasn't planning a counterattack of some type. So she talks about uh, all that stuff of uh, helping uh, Shadow find the village and uh, finish his investigation. So they fight each other and then uh, Sonic's trying to talk sense into Shadow like saying... You know, Dr. Eggman may have been bad, but he was good. Like, remember the time, uh, the business on the Ark when he helped uh, save the world and everything, even though he was aiming to destroy it and stuff like that. Then he talked about the alien invasion that he helped them with, and they may have not lasted uh, long enough to save the day. And you could see that look in Shadow's eyes, like saying, like, hmm, you got a point there. And then uh, Shadow's like saying, haven't you forgotten he made you suffer and try to destroy you multiple times and all that stuff. And then he's like saying, you tried to destroy me too. So basically, after all, he can't be forgiven. He can't be forgiven, so can you? Then after that, he really talks sense to him. So he's just asking, you know, what is his plan uh, for him? And basically, it's to stay in the village because he's been helping out with other things. And Sonic's been actually trying to nail down what he thinks uh, Eggman Land is all about. And all that stuff. So Shao uses Chaos Control to get back to the village. Where Sonic tries to uh, come back also. So um, he just talks with Mr. Tinker. And then says show me Eggman Land now. And basically Eggman Land was this. And after that I was like. Um, okay. And uh, Ruzai like saying. Ooh that looks so threatening. So then he's like saying that uh, he thought there was a nice play space and stuff like that and um, all that other stuff of just trying to find out uh, all that. So um, that was really it. Like there was no really, uh, I mean it was like a little brief fight but then they talked out of uh, all that stuff and uh, well then it's just uh, that happening. Sonic shaking hands with... Mr. Tinker. But see, here's the thing now. Elsewhere, Cubot and Orbot are in the spaceship where Dr. Eggman is. But now he's like saying, it's time for me to join the Egg Fleet. It's time to move on to the next phase of my master plan. So wait, what? But we just saw, so who is next time? Answers. So here's what my theory is. I think Mr. Tinker could be a clone that Dr. Eggman created to be put on the uh, island just so that way they could distract Sonic. Maybe. That's just my 
hypothesis. I could be wrong, but I'm guessing that's what it is. And we'll find out next month to find out what's going to be uh, going on in the next issue of uh, Sonic. So, um, wow. So, uh, really interesting comic book. I like the whole um, fight that they had, even though it was kind of a little brief, but... Then again, it was for the right reasons to uh, find out what was going on. And that was it for that. So, I have to say that I really enjoyed this issue. Uh, rating I get for this is between a 4.5, close to 5 out of 5, uh, book of the week. Even though it's reviewed late. Uh, all work was great and the story was really great as well. And I would definitely say pick this up if you're a Sonic the Hedgehog fan because I highly recommend you guys will like this comic book. And if not, then you won't, but it's up to you. But uh, I really enjoy this issue and I'm really glad, like I said before, that this is an ongoing series rather than just a miniseries for that. So uh, definitely pick this up. Even if, and if you're like me who likes the whole Shadow versus Sonic thing rivalry from video games. i played video games in the past, that's why I like that. But anyway guys... That's my comic review of Sonic the Hedgehog, issue number 6, digitally reviewed from IDW. Before I go, don't forget to check out these sources. Frontline.com, Zonefulpodcast.com, and YouTube Game Channel, Frontline Gaming Zone. All those three are your normal source for comic and game lane news reviews and a bunch more. Leave your comments in the comment section, your thoughts, likes, dislikes. Are you a Shadow fan? Are you a Sonic fan? Are you both fans? Who do you think will win a fight? It's Sonic would, right? I mean, I, I know I'm right. Or anything else you have to say to the questions, please feel free to leave in the comments section. I'll try to get back to you guys as soon as I can. And please, for your support uh, that you show on this channel, and if you're new, please hit that subscribe button so it'll be in your subscription box. You won't miss out on any videos that will be daily for you guys, or try to upload daily for you guys. And uh, your support matters, and we would really, uh, and we really appreciate that you support this channel. I'm running out of things to say because I'm tired. <laughs> All right. So tell me what your comic book readers out there. Mike Comfron saying take care. And as always, don't forget to keep watching. Later, everybody.